everyone and welcome back to Portal. Um, so, I had a bit of a problem recording before uh, in that, like an idiot, I forgot to press record when it came to the third part, so now we are back. Uh, having already completed the game uh, earlier today and now I'm doing this last part all over again. Because I'm stupid. <laughs> Let's go! It was a fun test, and we're all impressed at how much you won. The test is over. Come back. screens like the sound just cuts out. Feels like something's gone wrong. Joys of the source era I guess. You're not even going the right way. Where do you think you're going? Because I don't think you're going where you think you're going. Speaking of the source era Didn't we have some fun, though? Remember? 
Mesa, um, the remake. <laughs> but yeah, never, never played Half Life 1. I do plan to at some point. But before that, I want to play, well, more Mass Effect, firstly, and then I'm thinking I'm going to play Life as well. Because I never actually played that, and I would really like to. Play. There's a guy voice my cave in the room. Is the reason I want to play it? God. Yeah. Yeah. Damn. Don't kill me! Are you the devil?
because I just I play too much Half Life. Well, you found me. Congratulations. Was it worth it? Because despite your violent behavior, the only thing you've managed to break so far is my heart. Maybe you could settle for that and we'll just call it a day. I guess we both know that isn't going to happen. You chose this path. Now I have a surprise for you. Deploying surprise in five, four. Time out for a second. That wasn't supposed to happen. Do you see that thing that fell out of me? What is that? It's not the surprise. I've never seen it before. Never mind. It's a mystery I'll solve later. By myself. Because you'll be dead. Where are you taking that thing? I wouldn't bother with that thing. My guess is that touching it will just make your life even worse somehow. You're kidding me. Did you just set that Aperture Science thing we don't know what it does into an Aperture Science Emergency Intelligence Incinerator? That has got to be the dumbest thing that- Whoa, 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 whoa. <laughs> the description Good news. I figured out what that thing you just incinerated did. It was a morality core they installed after I flooded the enrichment center with a deadly neurotoxin to make me stop flooding the enrichment center with a deadly neurotoxin. So get comfortable while I warm up the neurotoxin emitters. Huh. That core may have had some ancillary responsibilities. I can't shut off the turret defenses. Oh well. If you want my advice, you should just lay down in front of a rocket. <laughs> than the neurotoxin. All right. Keep doing whatever it is you think you're doing. Killing you and giving you good advice aren't mutually exclusive. The rocket really is the way to go. That thing you burned up isn't important to me. It's the fluid catalytic cracking unit. What happens? You think you're doing some damage? Two plus two is... In base four, I'm fine. I let you survive this long because I was curious about your behavior. Well, you've managed to destroy that part of me. Unfortunately, I can't go toxin into your head any faster. I'd just like to point out that you were given every opportunity to succeed. There was even going to be a party for you. A big party that all your friends were invited to. I invited your best friend, the Companion Cube. Of course, he couldn't come because you murdered him. All your other friends couldn't come either because you don't have any other friends because of how unlikable you are. It says so right here in your personnel file. Unlikable, liked by no one. A bitter, unlikable loner whose passing shall not be mourned. Shall not be mourned. That's exactly what it says. Very formal. Very official. It also says you were adopted. So that's funny too. Speaking of curiosity, you're Neurotoxin. <laughs> So deadly. I don't know this problem. When I said deadly neurotoxin, the deadly was in massive sarcasm quote. I could take a bath in this stuff. Put it in cereal, rub it right into my eye. Me. You, on the other hand, are going to find its deadliness a lot less funny. Who's gonna make the cake when I'm gone? You. Look. You're wasting your time. And believe me, you don't have a whole lot left to waste. What's your point anyway? Survival. Well then, the last thing you want to do is hurt me. I have your brain scanned and permanently backed up in case something terrible happens to you. Which it's just about to. Don't believe me? Here, I'll put you on. That's you. That's how dumb you sound. You've been wrong about every single thing you've ever done, including this thing. You're not smart. You're not a scientist. You're not a doctor. You're not even a full-time employee. 
Where did your life go so long? Are you trying to escape? <laughs> Things have changed since the last time you left the building. What's going on out there will make you wish. <laughs> Thank you for assuming the party air code submission position. Well, I guess we don't have the sequel. The original race of Portal didn't have that scene. It just ended with Gladys dying. But then obviously they made the second one, so uh, they needed to bridge it somehow. It's time for the absolute bot that is still alive. This was a triumph. I would sing along, but I, I think I would just note here, ruin it. So. <laughs> it's hard to overstate my satisfaction. Aperture science. We do what we must because we can. For the good of all of us, except the ones who are dead. But there's no sense crying over every mistake. You just keep on trying till you run out of cake. And the science gets done, and you make a neat con for the people who are still alive.
to pop. Well, thank you everyone for sticking with it and for enduring my mumbling the entire time. So yeah, uh, in terms of future plans, I will be playing Portal 2 um, and Black Mesa again, probably, and then I'll be doing a Femshop playthrough. I'm up Sentinel playthrough of the Mass Effect trilogy. So, yeah, we all look forward to that. Thanks for watching.